Brad Hogg showed a bit of form too, but what soon followed was Darren Lehman smashing his way into the World Cup record books. Facing the bowling of Rudy Van Furen, the left-hander hit an amazing 28 runs off the final over. One boundary followed another as the Namibian fielders simply stood and stared at the ball flying past them to the boundary. The unfortunate bowler, Mr Van Furen, couldn't quite believe it, but it was getting worse. Lehman was in quite fantastic form, and umpire Billy Bowden was following him with his weird signalling. That one off the edge, but it raced away to the boundary rope. There's the umpire Billy Bowden. Lehman then decided to step up a gear, clubbing Van Furen's fourth delivery high over the rope and into the crowd. Six more to the all-rounder. It was great stuff for the crowd, though. It was a visibly exhausted Van Furen now, and his worst nightmare continued as Lehman again found the rope with the fifth delivery of the over. 22 so far, and one ball still to come. It was a full toss that gave Lehman the chance to smash the final ball in the same direction. 28 off the over. This a new World Cup record. And Australia had made 301 for six off their 50 overs. Van Furen was left with the figures of 0 for 92 from 10. Darren Lehman was left as the Australian hero. And didn't they all just love it? Yeah, that Australian total looked far too much for the Namibian batsman. Lehman's 28 off the over eclipsed Brian Lara's previous World Cup record of 26 by two runs. The Namibian openers came to the crease knowing that they could expect no favours from the Australians, and indeed, that's exactly how it proved.